द रेयर स्पाइनी टेल्ड लिजर्ड बाय चेतन मिश्र द स्कॉचिंग क्लाइमेट ऑफ द डेजर्ट पोजेस टफ चैलेंजेस टू इट्स इन्हाबिटेंट्स बट दीज इन्हाबिटेंट्स ऑफ द रेल्म आर इवन टफ बैटल हार्ड एंड टू अडेप्ट एंड थ्राइव इन दीज हार्श रीजन फॉर अ स्मॉल बॉडीड स्पीशीज नॉट ओनली द हार्श क्लाइमेट ऑफ द डेजर्ट बट ऑल्सो अ रेंज ऑफ प्रेडिटर्स इन द लैंडस्केप इंक्लूडिंग ह्यूमन्स मेक द सर्वाइवल अनसर्टन वन सच स्पेशलिस्ट ऑफ दिस एरियड लैंडस्केप लिव्स बिनीथ द बर्निंग सर्फेस ऑफ द थार डेजर्ट It was September in the year 2011 while on a birding expedition in Jorbeer Conservation Reserve with my college professor a lagar falcon sitting on an electric pole dropped something while taking off up close the fallen object appeared to be a half eaten lizard with only the tail part remaining it was an indian spiny tailed lizard or the sara hardwicki its thick tail with lines of spiny scales particularly grabbed my attention and i wanted to see the lizard alive and intact at least one time in my lifetime this wish to sight this amazing creature came true when i reached the bunny grasslands of the kutch in gujarat to study the indian desert fox for my master's dissertation in 2014 surprisingly I found several individuals of the Indian spiny-tailed lizards within the campus of our field station situated in the center of the village of Hodko in Banni. Even with the regular disturbance of visitors and movement of vehicles these individuals bred and foraged in the same campus. The the Indian spiny-tailed lizard measures around 40 cm in size and is a herbivorous lizard endemic to the indian subcontinent it is found among the arid and semi arid grasslands and deserts of western rajasthan and the kutch of gujarat in india and in the thar desert parts of pakistan some observations have reported scattered colonies of the indian spiny tailed lizard from parts of uttar pradesh and the sariksha tiger reserve in eastern rajasthan both regions fall out of the desert bio geographic zone it is only herbivorous it is the only herbivorous lizard in india the adult diet is strictly limited to herbs and grasses while the juveniles have been reported to feed on insects along with other vegetation at times The burrow of an Indian spiny-tailed lizard is unique and can be distinguished from any bur- other burrowing animal of the landscape by its entrance which is in the shape of a crescent moon. While resting in the burrow, the lizard blocks the entrance with its circled tail and seals the burrow with soil to prevent unwanted guests. The Indian spiny-tailed lizard is an important part of the desert food chain. high glycogen and fat contained in the body make it key prey for uh, key prey species for many predators in the desert the lizard faces predatory threats from both the land and the air the landscape of the indian spiny tailed lizard supports many resident and migratory birds of prey the red sand boa a common species of constrictor snake in the thar desert seems to be a major reptilian predator of the indian spiny tailed lizard and has been frequently pulling out of the lizards pulling lizards out of their burrows to feed with such a diverse range of predators from different trophic groups the indian spiny tailed lizard has developed several anti predator tactics to survive Though the lizard does not have any offensive anti-predator mechanisms its colored coat is well mixed with the surroundings of the desert making it hard for predator to spot if the camouflage doesn't work against predators the lizard relies on its speed to outrun the predators along with speed the indian spiny tailed lizard remains extremely vigilant during foraging The lizard often forages in a proximity of their burrows 
and even a slight movement in the surrounding can make them rush back to the burrow. The Indian spiny-tailed lizard is locally well renowned as the sanda or sandho in its distribution range in the country and oil extracted from its fat a very famous traditional medicine due to its medicinal use the lizard is hunted widely by local nomads and poachers in the desert the lizard is also being hunted for its meat as it is considered as a delicacy in many communities in its distribution range the question the question remains if the indian spiny tail lizard with its speed and vigilance can outrun the threat of extinction in today's world where natural habitats are paying the cost for urban development and biodiversity conservation is being overlooked